A notorious hacking group claims to have stolen personal data from half a billion Ticketmaster customers. The group Shiny Hunters claims that it has obtained names, addresses, phone numbers, partial credit card details from Ticketmaster and Live Nation customers. And it says that it is selling the data for a half a million dollars in a quote one-time sale so to break it all down for us and whether or not we should be pretty nervous we are joined by senior business and tech correspondent joe ling kent uh so what do we know what should customers know Hi, guys. Good morning. Well, you first should know that Ticketmaster and Live Nation are not commenting on this, and CBS News has not independently verified the hack itself, even though the hackers are trying to take credit for this. The most important things that you should do in this particular case is know that most people who've purchased a concert ticket have interacted with Ticketmaster and the parent company Live Nation, right? That's pretty simple. So there's a few steps that you can take to protect yourself and to give yourself some tools and take a little bit of action. First of all, you can change your usernames and passwords. You also always want to be monitoring your credit card and debit card activity. If you've had any sort of purchase on Ticketmaster, you want to take a close look for any suspicious activity. You also want to call your credit card company. And if you are feeling worried about this, you could initiate a fraud alert. And that's something where you can ask to freeze your card. And that would also prevent it and make it harder for someone to make new accounts in your name and damage your credit report. But overall, this is a major issue for Ticketmaster and Live Nation, its parent company, because they're already under so much scrutiny. We've seen these hacker hackers in action before, but we also know that the Department of Justice just last week filed an antitrust lawsuit against Live Nation and Ticketmaster, saying that they have a stranglehold and they're acting illegally in a monopolistic manner to uh, dominate ticket sales. And in doing so, that they are breaking antitrust law. So Ticketmaster certainly under the microscope right now, but if you are concerned about this hack, you, there are a few steps that you can take to try to protect yourself, guys. All right, uh, Jolene Kent, always great to have you breaking down uh, what is a really important story because we're talking about millions of people that are affected by this. Uh, Jolene Kent, thank you very much. Thanks.